NIBFA TV was at Dublin in South Belfast for this National League A clash at under 16 level between Oliver Plunkett and Crusaders. Oliver Plunkett are in their white and black stripes with Crusaders in their traditional red and black. Here's Crusaders player Jack O'Mani going close in the early stages. Then it was Donal Rocks for Oliver Plunkett clearing his lines with this last ditch clearance. At the other end, Mark McKenna was the danger man for Oliver Plunkett. He forced Matty Anderson into this save before blasting over the crossbar with a long range effort. Then it was Chad Cochran's turn to try his luck from long range, but this one was nowhere near the target. Oliver Plunkett were able to cause Crusaders a few problems with their set pieces. The first goal for Crusaders arrived in the 36th minute with some fine work on the left hand side from Eamon McLaughlin before Nathan Bass tapped home from close range. Oliver Plunkett almost fought straight back but this effort from Sean Wallace went wide of the post. Patrick Slane looks like a young Declan Cattell for Crusaders, but this effort didn't quite match up to the standard of the first team players. And this effort is perhaps best forgotten. Then it was Sean Duffy's turn to force Declan Dunn into a save with this effort. Oliver Plunkett's pushed for an equaliser, but to no avail. And it was Owen Flynn who got the second goal of the game to make it a 2-0 victory for Crusaders. Here is what the under-16s manager, Gary McAllister, had to say about this fine win. I'm really proud of the lads. You know, I thought they battled really, really well throughout the whole game. It was a tight game right up until the last minute when we scored the second goal. But I think we were stuck with them to very little. And Slaver Plunkett are a good side. They won the league last year and have a lot of good players. But I thought we were very good with the ball. When we had it, we used it well. We're missing three or four players with injury. But as I said before, we have a really good squad here. And all our lads came in and were excellent. I thought Paul and Jack both coming back in the team were fantastic on the right and left hand side. And I thought we took our two goals well and deserved probably to win the game through the, through the run of it. Plunkett over the last few years have had a lot of good results over us. So it's nice to finally get out and get, get a win because I think We've been due one, so we're happy. The lads are looking good today, so happy Saturday. Perfect.